it fair that I forget myself in you yet? You forget me when my presence no longer lingers. When your laundry basket is no longer full of your clothes that I wore. When my tiny feet are no longer causing havoc to your carpet because Mool is trying to convince my two left feet that we can dance. When my head no longer rests on your chest and you have to remind me to cover up my green hair because it doesn't taste as good as it looks. They say what you don't know won't hurt you. I beg to differ. It is the pain I am feeling that you don't know about that will make me leave you and that will hurt you. It is that other man who will comfort me that you don't know about. He will treat me better and that will hurt you. It is that other woman that I don't know about that will slowly drain the life out of our relationship and that will hurt me. It is your ignorance of my pain that hurts me the most. My chest met his knife and his knife became the pen to this paper and the paper became the host to this pain and this pain read something like this. In the beginning, Dracula met Martha and it was written, no two souls were ever more meant for each other, was how we started. I was everything he was afraid to let himself want. See, intelligence is an intoxicating quality in a woman. It will draw you in, manipulate all your systems and decode all your programs. I had infiltrated his heart, but I hit a firewall when I got to his brain. At that point, at that moment, put to the test of loving a person, loving someone for who they really are, not just the bits we like. I saw the man behind the smiles, the claw beneath the glow, trying to save himself from drowning slow, a drowning man clutching on straws, to redeem himself from secrets he'd stored, stored and locked away, but they kept pounding away in that dark corner in his brain, demanding, craving, shouting, wanting to be let out. But he never let them out, so a fire broke out and he could no longer hold a cow and then a slave being a bad master came about. Then his secrets started to keep him. He became vulnerable to me and I became Anastasia still and he was Christian Grey punishing me for his Fifty Shades of Messed Up. Let's take a minute to talk about this distinct instinct to break the link when a person is on the brink of bringing down that last wall, that barrier that is the carrier of the pain of the past, the pain of love, lust, and broken trust. So further from me he grew, protecting his secrets more than he protected me. See, things fall apart when you don't take care of them. And the pain began. The pain of you suddenly becoming busy, the pain of things coming up, the pain of lies about foreign ties, the pain of neglect, the pain flowed to my heart and it was pumped to my throat where it chokes me, it was pumped to my lungs where it suffocates me, it was pumped to my chest where it burns me and this, this isn't even a half of the abuse. How am I supposed to love a person who rejects me over and over? A person whose secrets have become a parasite, gradually draining the life out of our relationship. A person who shut me out because I went too deep. A person who will give me time because time heals all wounds. If my pain could write you a letter, it would sound something like this. Dear Mr. Jayla, you know not who I am yet. You are my creator. I would like to thank you for fueling me and igniting me on occasion, for giving me energy to start a fire in my host. However, as much as I delight in this uphill task accorded to me, I would love to request that I be reassigned to a new host as my current host is worn out. It is my concern, as ironical as it is, that the restless days and sleepless nights caused by the anxiety I planted and grew in her have gradually robbed her of her identity and her worthiness to host me has been compromised. As my handler, it is your duty to find me a more deserving environment to continue my reign of terror. P.S. If I was you, I would get rid of me. I would sign up with an old-fashioned, with love, pain, but one cannot give what one does not have, so with undisclosed feelings, pain. Welcome to Array Shire.